What's up, YouTube? This is FoxDive555, and I am bringing you a new little segment that I am doing called Tomb Raider Retro. And right here, I have to fix something in my settings. <laughs> but uh, what I'm going to be doing in this little segment is I'm going to be playing levels from the classic PlayStation 1 Tomb Raiders, you know, Tomb Raider 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And I'm going to be playing the levels that I particularly remember the most and impacted me a lot and, you know, levels that I thought should be noted for being outstanding, outstandingly made levels. So, without further ado, here we go. So, this level is called City. It is on Tomb Raider 3, and it's the last level of the London section. And what you're doing is you're trying to kill that girl shooting the green laser beam stuff at me. Her name is Sophia Lee, or Lee. I think it's Sophia Lee, actually. But she has an artifact, or one of four pieces of an artifact, where you, in Antarctica, where you combine them and all of this other stuff that involves a story that doesn't relevant to this level, but pretty much she has something really, really important and we need to get it. And the reason why I like this level so much is the, uh, Environment is really, really unique. You, you're on top of buildings on London with like the green moon, which you'll see later. And it's just, I think it's a unique boss fight and it's a unique atmosphere. And I figured, hey, why don't I do this with my first one? And it's a nice short one, so I can get a nice little intro into the series in it too. So I think that helps out a lot. And what I just did right there was I found the one and only secret on this level. So it's a rocket and a large med pack, I think. So what we need to do is on this level you need to get to the top of the building that you're at and then she's on the buildings over there and on your side there's a fuse box at the top and then when you get to that part she's standing on like a metal platform or whatever and when you shoot the fuse box it electrifies her and she blows the crap up so that'll be a little interesting thing for you guys to see and I don't know if you guys have noticed yet but um, there's certain points where I stand still and I'll do like a backflip over it or something when she charges up her shot like that, it's a one-hit kill. So you need to time it perfectly. So, yeah. So, um... Let's see here. Tomb Raider 1 and Tomb Raider Last, Last Revolution are probably my favorite games in the series. I, I uh, have been replaying all of them. Like, I started with 1 and I've been working my way through. And I'm at, um, the... What level is that? RX Tech Mines on this level, on this game. And I've found that, surprisingly, Tomb Raider 3 used to be my least favorite of the Tomb Raiders in the series. But on, on this replay value, I've actually found that I've been liking this game a lot more than I used to. Like, see right here, I have she's charging up and then I have to wait and time it. Yeah. But I, I like Tomb Raider 3 a lot better than I used to. But I had always liked this level and, like, a few others. But I, I found out that the overall game I enjoyed much better. So, yeah. <laughs> um, let's see here. Kind of, this is still slightly nervous for me because this is my, like I said, this is my, I don't think I said this maybe. Well, I actually had like seven outtakes on this because this isn't my first live comp. I'm recording this over the gameplay, which is the first time I've ever done it. I don't know if I said that or not. And I've messed up like seven times already. And so, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm still kind of new at this. I, I like this better than the live comp, but, you know, I gotta, you gotta make sure everything's perfect and stuff. And, Really nerve wracking, but here we have the fuse box, and it's really awesome how she blows up. Just whoosh. I think it's sweet. So, yeah, now I would walk back over on that platform, but the floor is electrified, so I need to go all the way around. Which also, right here, she like climbs up the ladder, but it's not a ladder right there, it's just a random like platform, which is kind of weird, but uh. Yeah, so this, this two minute retro series is going to be, I, I'm looking forward to it, it's going to be really fun. Uh, if you guys enjoyed this, or if you hated it, like or dislike, it doesn't matter, I mean, as long as you get your opinion out there, it helps me pick which content to make and stuff, and it helps my channel grow. And also subbing, subscribing, would be really, really cool, because then you guys can see the other levels I pick, and I think it would appreciate, I would appreciate it very much, and I cannot hit that button to save my life right now. So, uh... Thanks for watching, guys. I will talk to you guys later, and I hope you really enjoy this new segment called Tomb Raider Retro. And that was the level city, so uh, Fox Die Out. And I will talk to you guys later.